adaptations. What does adaptations mean in terms of organisms? The features that organisms have that make them better suited for their environment. How are the organisms which have adapted to their environment more likely to survive, reproduce and pass on their adaptation to their offspring? They are better able to compete for resources. What are specialists? Organisms which are highly adapted to survive in the specific habitat. What are generalists? Organisms which are adapted to survive in a range of different environments. What is extreme morphophiles? Organisms that can tolerate extreme conditions. What are extremophile bacteria that live in hot con environments? Ex enzymes that work best at a much higher optimum temperature than enzymes in from other organisms. What do organisms that live in a very cold environment have? Special antifreeze proteins. What do these proteins do? Interfere with the formation and growth of ice crystals in the cell, stopping cell damage from ice. What are anatomical adaptions? Features of an organism's autonomy that help it survive. What examples of anatomical adaptions are there? Having thick coat are a layer of blubber to insulate the body and trap heat in. Having a large size and compact body shape to give a small surface area to volume ratio. Having countercurrent heat exchange systems. What do the blood vessels going to and from the feet of a penguin carry? Blood that flows in opposite directions. What do the vessels that pass close to each other allow? Heat to transfer between them. What does the warm blood flow in arteries to the feet do? Heat cold blood returning to the heart in the veins. What does this mean? Feet stay cold but stops cold blood colonizing the rest of the body. Why do many species migrate to warmer climates during the winter? To avoid having to cope up with cold conditions. Why do some species hibernate during the winter months? To save energy. How do organisms keep cool in hot environments? Increasing heat loss and reducing heat gain. What behavioural adaptions do organisms use to increase heat loss and reduce heat gain? Stay in shade, active at night rather than day, bathing in water. What autonomical adaptions do organisms use to increase heat loss? Small size, another way is large ears allows more blood to flow near the surface of the skin, meaning heat from the blood can be radiated to its surroundings. Or store fat in one area allows heat to be lost more easily. Why do some desert plants have a round shape? To give them a small surface area to volume ratio to minimize water loss from surface. Why do some desert plants have a thick waxy layer and spines instead of leaves? To reduce water loss. Why do some desert plants store water in their stems to survive droughts? Why do some desert plants have a shallow and extensive root? To ensure water is absorbed quickly over a large area. Why do some desert animals have specialized kidneys? To produce concentrated urine. 
why do some desert animals have no sweat glands? So there's no water loss through sweating. Why do some desert animals spend lots of time in underground burrows? Air is more moisture than on the surface.